organization, say it with me, organization. Your passion led you here. Yes, your passion led you here. So I want you to, when you're talking about having the 10 keys to unlock your full career uh, potential, you need to be organized. You need to see what's going to be before you. What are you passionate about? What is that thing that is driving you? What gets you up in the morning to start your day? I had a conversation with someone this morning and he was telling me about when he gets up, he thanks someone in particular just for getting on his feet in the morning because he realizes that just by getting on your feet, there's so many people that didn't have that opportunity. So whatever your passion is in life, whatever that thing is that, that has really been knocking at your back door, that has really been in the back of your mind that you really haven't brought forward into full fruition in your life, begin to look at that passion. Begin to visualize that passion and begin to act on that passion because you got to understand that when you're organized, when you begin to see these things that you want to do in your life, that's when you begin to take action to make it happen. I had to give a presentation on the three E's of leadership. And this is where my three E's come in. It helps me all the time. The first E is execute. Execute. The next E is empower. And the last E is excel. You see, when you execute on anything you want to do in life, it will empower you to do it at a better level. And then you will excel to higher heights. Execute, empower, and excel. So when you're organized, you have that, that forecasting mindset, that's what you begin to do. Because organization and having a vision board is critically important. I usually, in my training, I have done this training in the past, and I put my, my true vision board up, but I, I can't do I, I got to stop doing that all the time. Everybody don't need to know all my business. So, so what I did was I just got a sample vision board. And it could be like this. You got different types of vision boards to help you be organized. But this vision board, just talk about different things that they want to accomplish, different places they want they see themselves, different things they want to do. But also you can get more detailed. Like my vision board, I look at daily. My vision board, I talk about what exactly I'm going to do right now, this month, what I'm going to do next month, how I forecast my finances, how I forecast all the various different things for my business and other activities I'm a part of. I go in detail with my vision board, and it's a big, long one that takes almost an entire wall because that's how I do it. Now, do you have to do it that way? No, you can have a simple one, something that really inspires you like this one here. But a vision board is critically important because it helps you forecast where you want to be. If you see yourself in that C-suite position, put it on a vision board. If you see yourself in a new position, put it on a vision board. What are the steps necessary in order to get you there? How are you going to do it? What's, going to, what's the things that are going to prevent you? How will you overcome those things? Have it on there. Be very clear and concise about that. 